Hello and welcome back. It is an honor and privilege to have you here. This is Paolo, your host, and this is another conversation in artificial intelligence. What it takes to build innovative and successful products in the field of artificial intelligence. When you read a book like uh, Crossing the Chasm and they show the normal product life cycle adoption curve, what a lot of people forget is that there's a set of personalities and buyers that map along that curve. And the people at the very front of that curve, they want to be involved in product development and in advancing their field. They have a passion. And if you engage, if you can find those people and engage them in the right way, you'll be very, very successful. Uh, in particular, as you build your product with them and you're rapidly putting you know, prototypes and working systems in front of them to get their feedback. That process, when you identify those right people, those people become the champions that later on are the people who convince the, the early adopters, for example, to, to buy your product and the mainstream adopters to buy your product. The second part is it's really easy to do this with a couple, two, three, four people. But when you actually get to bigger teams that are globally distributed, it's really important that you capture that information and that you summarize it in the right way. So use where you can a lot of recordings and use a lot of the standard tools that are out there. There's a reason that people invented personas or they invented journey maps. Those things are ways to distill information that's pretty complicated into something that everybody can understand. And it's something that's many times easy to ignore, but when you actually use them and you do them well, they become very, very powerful tools. What you want to do is you want to be lean in how you approach things. You want to always do small iterations. And when you get all of this information from an expert, for, for example, what you want to be able to say is, I'm confident that I don't need to build this feature right now. I can build this feature. Uh, I can build this feature later. Honestly, just getting that right community of people is invaluable in the very beginning. And it's, it's fi find the people who are interested in the evolution of this market, um, ask them for their, for their assistance. And you don't need a lot of time. You'd be surprised that five to 10 people with four to eight hours over a three or four month period from each of them is a substantial amount of time uh, for you. It's a little bit of time from them and um, you'll learn a, a massive amount.